Hey guys, it's OSAS from Samsung Galaxy S3 Soft Modder. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get the Galaxy S4 lock screen onto your Galaxy S3 device. So the first thing we're going to do is go into the Play Store and search for Galaxy 4 lock screen without a space. And it's going to be this first one right here. I'm pretty sure that's Chinese, but I'm not positive. We're just going to click on that and install it. And once it's installed, it'll be added to your home screen. And we're just going to go there. Um, and enable it right here tap on that and then you're probably going to want to disable your other lock screens because otherwise you would have two lock screens and so we're going to either hit swipe or none I'll just go with swipe and I'll just show you what it looks like before we start messing with the settings and there you go I've already changed a couple things around as you can see and there's the blood effect and then I've also changed it it says life companion by default but I'll show you how you can actually go and change those. Oh. As you can see, I did not disable my lock screen. So you can just hit none, which actually is better instead of swiping twice to open it. Um, right here you hit theme. It's um, in the light theme right now, so I can go from blood to blue rings. Or I can change it to the ripple effect right here. And change the color in this list right here. If I want to change the, the text that's at the top, you go to personalization, and then right here, edit profile. And you can also change the font and the size, clock font, clock size, etc. So that's all in the personalization center. Um, I mean, that's basically all you need to know. Here it is right here. There's the, the new effect, the, the green, green ink that I chose. You slide it. Now that I disabled my other lock screen, it goes straight. Um, if you do want to have your other lock screen, if you're... I'm afraid of security lapses or whatever, you can um, <clears throat> leave that installed. You're just obviously going to have to swipe once and then enter in your, your gadget tree at the next screen. Here, as you can see, when I tap there, you can also add different shortcuts or change the, the default ones. So, just do that. You lock it up. Turn it on. And there it is. Um, so that's really it. It's the, the Galaxy S4 lock screen on your GS3 device. No more missing out on the coolness of a new phone. You actually have it right on your old phone. So make sure to check out the full tutorial on Samsung Galaxy S3 Soft Modder. And make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Thanks, guys.